gone. He's like gone, not not for a day, not for a week, not for a year, but he's gone forever. I'm never gonna hear his voice again. I'm never gonna see his face. I'm never gonna feel his arms around me. He's never coming back. He's gone, and it's all my fault. You didn't split up with him on, on some whim. Look, you really believed that that was the only choice that you had. You did what you had to do for you and your son. Oh, I was so selfish. We stop. Stop that. You're not selfish. You put Robbie first. And I don't know, maybe... Maybe that's what Danny did, too. I mean, he agreed to walk away, didn't he? Yes, He yes, agreed. But... He made that choice. And I, I, I can't say why. Maybe he felt that it was the only choice that he had because he loved you just as much as you loved him. No, Bill. He loved me more. You're shivering. Why don't we go back inside? You know, I'm, I've said everything I'm going to say. You're supposed to be with Beth. Look, she'll understand. Thank you so much. You're the best. I got Rick and Mel and my dad in there. And even if I wanted to be alone, they wouldn't let me be. I'm okay. Sure. Go be with Beth. All right. But look, I'm going to call you first thing in the morning, okay? And if you need anything before then, will you call me, please? Please. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be all right. I love you. Same here. out of here. You're not allowed to be in here, okay? Look how beautiful my boy looks. <laughs> Look how beautiful he looks. Don't do this to yourself. I want to hold him. No, I have to hold him. Come on, let's go. Let's get you out of here. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. scare you. I, I just, I thought I would, I need to come on to your dad. Um, he's inside with Rick. 
You okay? Oh, uh, I guess you haven't heard. Heard what? Um, the reason I, I couldn't find Danny is, uh, is because he's dead. No. Carmen killed him. But God knows if they're, they're ever gonna be able to prove it. I'm so sorry. I just want to crawl in a, in a corner and, and sleep and never wake up. And I know I can't because I got Robbie. No, you can't. But you'll... You'll get through this, you know, and, and, and I... I know you don't believe this right now, but I want you to listen to me. It will get easier. Do you hear me? Soon, it will get easier. I can't even think that far ahead. I'm just, like, worried about coping with tomorrow. Yeah. You know the worst part? I didn't get to say goodbye. Yeah, I didn't get to say goodbye to Richard. It's, it feels so wrong, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. It's almost like... If I didn't get to say goodbye, then he can't really be gone. He must still be here. You gonna come in? What? He says that you needed to talk to my dad. Oh, you know, um, it really wasn't that important, so. Well, thanks for listening to me. Anytime. Anytime. You never meant to hurt him. That slug that you put into Danny. You never meant to hurt him. You never wanted to kill him, did you? Just wait outside. Outside. Okay, well, the DA personally asked me to check to make sure Danny's hands are I already did that. Cooper, I already did that. to say to me, you do it through my lawyer. The more rattled Carmen gets, the more likely she is to slip up and incriminate herself. Okay. So this is almost over? Yeah. So... Well, that's a good thing. Because, um... I saw Michelle. What? When I went you to go find Ed, yeah, I did. Well, you didn't tell her. No, I anything, didn't did tell her, but she told me a lot, Danny. She is a wreck. And she said she doesn't know how she can go on without you. And she completely lost it. She completely lost it with Bill. And I am telling you that this is tearing her apart.
I was just now. The morgue. Viewing my dead son's body. You saw that? Your grief is touching, Michelle, really. Considering you're the reason why he's dead.